What's good NBA Nation 22 Khalil here and welcome to episode 2 of Laker Rumors. And to start off, it looked like the Lakers had expressed serious interest in former Heat guard Deion Waiters as both sides plan to meet March 2nd. Weeks prior around the All-Star break, it was said that the Lakers are going to talk to Deion Waiters sometime in the near future. The potential driving force behind this is the previous relationship of Rob Palenka and Deion Waiters. Before Palenka came to the Lakers, he was an agent for multiple years and it turns out that he used to manage Deion Waiters. Also, as of right now, Waiters is being managed by good old Clutch Sports. As I said in my last video, despite the injuries, I think Deion Waiters is a very solid player. Ball handling and shot creating is a big weakness off the bench for the Lakers, and adding him to the bench could be a big positive for them. Also, if anybody can get the best out of Waiters, it would be Palinka. Next up in the Windy City, it looks like Zach Levine is unhappy with the Bulls, as clips of him looking unpleased with coaching has surfaced on social media. Also, Levine added fuel to the fire when he was on first take, hinting that he would like to play with LeBron and AD in his hometown of LA. Now, I think that Levine is a very good player. However, I don't think the Lakers have enough pieces to make a trade like that. Also, let's be honest, as bad as the Bulls front office has been, I don't think that they would be dumb enough to trade a player like Zach Levine for the likes of Kyle Kuzma, Danny Green, and maybe a first round pick. Either though I think that Levine will seek a trade if changes aren't made in Chicago, I don't think that the Lakers are a possible destination. Now guys, that's it for the rumor report. If y'all think the Lakers should sign Deion Waiters or attempt to trade for Zach Levine next offseason, voice off in the comment section. But anyways, it's 22 Khalil, and as they say in Japan, job out today. Peace.